We continue to follow breaking news out of Shawnee, Kansas right now. A longtime family restaurant is destroyed in a fire. It started around 1.30 this morning, and crews are still working to put it out. This is all taking place at 75th and Neiman Road. That's just off of I-35. Sloan Heller is on the scene this morning. She joins us live with more. Good morning, Sloan. Good morning, Beth. Uh, Pega's Family Restaurant, uh, old school American restaurant, was built about 13 years ago. Uh, the owner, who moved here from Iran about 20 years ago, said he named it after his daughter. And so clearly a very sentimental place to him, a total loss to him now, but also we're told a huge loss to this community. This uh, was a place where people came on a regular basis. A lot of people talked about coming here as children, still coming here today. And now again, this is a total loss. Destroyed uh, just about 1:45 this morning, and crews were telling us by the time they got here, it was just too late to save this restaurant. They could only fight it from the outside. Uh, the whole restaurant kind of collapsed on itself. The fire underneath it all, and now it's really just a shell, just a brick shell. The walls around still standing. Nothing inside. No roof. It's all gone. Uh, we did talk to a gentleman who was out here early this morning. He's been a regular. Take a listen to what he had to say. It's not, it's not just uh, a building burning down. It's one of my childhood memories kind of burning down. It's, uh, it's a pretty serious thing. Now, at this point, it's still so early on. Uh, crews are still putting it out, and then we're told once the daylight hits, they're going to start the investigation process and hopefully find out where this fire started, how it started. Uh, I asked the owner if he plans to rebuild, and he said, you know, he's got insurance, but he has to wait and find out how much he's actually going to get to find out if he can afford to rebuild again this longtime family restaurant. Live in Shawnee this morning, Sloan Heller, NBC Action News today.